hi guys welcome back to my channel Oof, it's been so long i said that um i've been so busy yeah life just hit me you know like a train but so today's video is a vlog this is the first day it's just like a three-day vlog i'm traveling to beijing because of some unfinished business that's very annoying but yeah so it's what's the time right now let me see uh it's nine it's 9 a.m and my flight leaves at two <laughs> but i'm dressed because i'm supposed to leave the house at like 9 15 and get to the airport bus there's an airport bus close to my house actually but the man was so rude and lazy and probably racist because he told me that foreigners can't book to get there which did not make sense and i went to another place and i, I could book it to get there so he was obviously lying so now the other place is like 30 minutes away from my house and the bus leaves at 10 a.m so if i leave my house at like 9 15 i get there in time the bus leaves at 10 a.m and then the bus to the airport the airport's like two hours away ish i guess one hour something or two hours away so let's say i leave at 10 and i get to the airport at 12 my flight is at 2 p.m so that's enough time right <laughs> yeah and then I, I arrive in beijing at five so i'm just almost done cleaning up my room so i come back to cleaning the stress free room let me go and get that done and then i'll finish dressing up and we can go i mean i can go okay so i just ordered the taxi dd whatever the guy's like seven minutes away i'm done dressing up and packing and i'm kind of excited because i need to just i don't know it'll be nice it'll be fun i hope but yeah let me go downstairs and just wait for him just so that everything can go smoothly <laughs> I don't know if you can hear me. I'm at Beijing and it has been a beautiful struggle. Oh my god, today was such a day. It's 11 degrees here. It's cold, but I'm not even feeling that cold because of this big jacket that I have on. Okay, let me see if that's my. Okay, right. so it's cold, but it's not that terrible. It's supposed to get colder apparently. Let's just see how everything works out. Um, yeah, I'm getting a DD from the airport to the place that I'm staying, and then I have to figure out my way. Good luck to me, and then I have to figure out what I'm gonna have for dinner. I think I'm going to this place called Lily's American Diner, but I don't know yet, Sha. Let's see how the Lord smiles on me. Peace. So, I just got to the Airbnb, it's quite large. Uh, let me just yeah sure from the door the first place is the bathroom and the washing area the lounge there's this design it's just this place looks kind of weird because it's just open it's such an open place there's a tv there's a whole couch situation going on. there's a kitchen too let me even see where's the light oh okay okay Oh, and there's a fridge in the microwave. It's big. And now the room. It feels so empty, my God. Ah, oh, this is the room. Okay. Not bad, not bad. There's a couch also in the room. This thing was open and it felt so weird, so I closed it. So, it feels so open and empty and creepy. And the design is so American in my mind that I don't even feel like I'm in China. This open thing is weird. It's scary. What the hell? Oh my god. All these faces. Okay, look at this woman without eyeballs. What the fuck? Oh, forgive me for cursing. I, I hope I don't think about this at night because I'm staying here alone. Look. Just see. Oh no. <laughs> if I didn't look at it properly before booking it, it looks so cool. Oh, it's going to be big. It doesn't even look like, okay, you're in China. Man, ah, oh, it's, it's okay, Sha. There's a mirror. 
right? I'm excited, Sha. I'm hungry. Let me eat food. Figure out what I'm going to eat. The lighting here is so poor. Uh, I'm so hungry. <laughs> And I'm so tired. It's so cold. I wanted to go out and have dinner, but it's so cold. I don't think I'll be going anymore. Oh, let me try to. Yeah, I don't think I'll be going anymore. Maybe I'll just order something. And yeah. Good morning. It's morning. I look so tired. It's 8 30, 27. I woke up at like 7 40 or so. Just feel so. Oh God, today I have to go to the Nigerian embassy and get it all done. And then I, ha I don't have anything to do for the rest of the day. I haven't showered yet. I will go and shower right now, very soon. And then dress up and go and uh, probably just come back home, stay indoors. I'm no longer so scared of this place again. <laughs> and I think maybe because I'm now getting more and more used to Oh god, my voice sounds so terrible. <clears throat> I think I'm not getting more and more used to the apartment, so I'm no longer as scared as I was last night. Okay, I had to even turn the pictures to the back <laughs> so I wouldn't go out in the night to pee or something and I see faces just looking at me. Very creepy. Oh yeah, the house is actually quite warm considering how cold it is outside. It's like when I woke up it was like one degree. But it's not cold inside because I closed all the doors and all the windows. So, so this is my view from this place. There isn't really anything to see. The train tracks over there. Where's my finger? Oh yeah, the train tracks over there. Buildings, buildings, some high rise, and a highway there, which is pretty at night. But that's about it. This is like the second one that I've seen this morning. I don't know how many passengers. Let me. Doesn't look as creepy in the morning because I actually like this big thing because it lets in a lot of light. But I wish there was a curtain because it's creepy at night. But yeah, see, I turned the pictures to the back because I cannot. This is what I had ordered yesterday. I had a burrito and I bought this spaghetti bolognese and. This came and I never opened it. I thought it was like tissue, and I don't know why I just put it back. Oh, it's bread. Oh, okay. Oh, this is <laughs> this is very nice. And the leftover um salsa blah 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 thingies. And now my pasta, which uh, which was in the fridge, so I'm just gonna put it in a minute. Because I don't think these can be microwave. You should not microwave anything for you, so. One, two, go food, go, go food, go. I'm so hungry. I just left right now i'm leaving right now because <laughs> i was there i was having a conversation with this man bless his soul he's such a nice person i think he's the ambassador man i don't know who he is but he was in his office and we talked for a very very long time because it's like 3 p.m and it was so nice of him to talk to me because you know what after getting okay i did come to get some documents verified but then I found out that I had to pay like 350 quiet, 350 RMB. And I was like, where am I going to get 350 RMB from? This was unplanned. I didn't know I was supposed to pay. But then I didn't know I was supposed to pay at first. So after getting my documents, then I went back to meet the man because I was told me that when I'm not, I should come back to him. So I was in his office and we're talking. So then he came and told me that I was supposed to pay. But the man was like, ah, don't worry. Since I'm his friend, I shouldn't pay. So, ah, I hope you can hear me. It's so noisy, but then so you see 
the way the Lord works. And that was how I didn't have to pay 350 kwai. I am so happy. At the same time, I'm so hungry. So I need to find, oh my hair. I need to find something to do. The original plan was to go and look for Taco Bell. I don't know if I'll still go. I'm, you know, skeptical. But I have to go look for Taco Bell. Because there's supposed to be one Taco Bell in Fuji. So in Beijing. So either I go look for Taco Bell or I go home. But what am I gonna do when I get home, you know? So maybe I will actually go and look for Taco Bell. Whew. But then you know what? This place is so beautiful. Look, let me show you properly. The trees here are so beautiful. Like they are all so golden and so autumn is so nice. And it's so busy. Welcome to Beijing. It's so cold and it's so beautiful at the same time. Let me look for her to get, find a way to get to the so called Taco Bell that's here in Beijing. I called my Didi, and the place is about 13 minutes. No, the place is 13 Kwai. So it should not be far at all. Um, let me just wait for him to get here. I don't know what car it is. I did not look at the plate number. Smart me. Mm. So the Taco Bell is in a mall called Hello Mart and it's like four minutes drive away, which is why it was just getting back. So cheap. Here and just in front is the Taco Bell. See? Let me zoom. Is there Taco Bell? Oh, I'm excited. Let me go closer. This Taco Bell better be worth it. Because I could have been at home in my bed, but I left all this place to come here to try out food. Because you don't want to come to Fujo. Let's go and see. <laughs> see what is on the menu. Okay, let's go. Um, okay, let me zoom. Oh, okay, see so the menu. Can you just clear up? No, it doesn't. They have the chicken rice. So I ordered and everything was 100 pie. Exactly 100 pie. I think it was that pie just because I was trying to try out. I, like, fuck, I wanted churros. And I forgot to add that to my menu. Well, there's always another time. I don't want to add anything else to my menu. I got. Well, you see when I get home, chat. But, ooh. Just ordered uh, my food and my Didi. This place is beautiful. There's weeping willow everywhere. See? Well, I'll show you properly. But yeah, this is my food. There was a sauce thingy that you could get your choose your own sauce dispensary. Blah blah blah. Well, I'll show a food review, but let me just try and capture these trees because they're so pretty. Oh my god, Vijay is so pretty. I hope you don't want to leave. I don't I don't miss Fujo as much as I missed it yesterday. I think yesterday I was just lonely and scared of my house, but now I'm not scared of the place anymore. I wish I had more money. I would stay for longer. I'm trying to capture these trees. I don't know. Do this qualify as weeping willow? Probably not. But then the dead trees give some kind of beautiful aesthetic too and then the 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 autumn trees you know the trees with the autumn colors so pretty so pretty so pretty i'm trying to see if i can get somebody to take a picture of me because i want a picture of me with the background of these trees um before my didi gets here so hopefully um if i'm lucky I haven't seen any persons passing by. Oh, there's this guy on his tree. Let me go ask him. To saw this nice boy, because I was able to get some nice pictures. They're so fishy and touristy, and I like them. That's exactly what I wanted. And he got them. And I'm going to insert them right now. Insert pictures. Go. Picture sound. Yeah, let me just wait for my DD. I want to go home now. I'm hungry. I want to eat. I don't want to go under my bed. I'm so hungry and my house is like 30 minutes away. So I'm gonna eat my fries here. I'm gonna like spice with whatever that's on them. But it tastes so good. So
Okay, so I'm home now. And I actually forgot what I ordered, but I opened this. These are nachos. These are, I think I ordered like a snack set. I think these were bones. I think they made a mistake with boneless or whatever. These are soft shell tacos, I guess. And this is hard shell. I don't know. Let me eat and see. And also, there were these sauces. This is sriracha. And, oh, <laughs> this is ketchup. Hi, guys. Poor lighting, I know. I'm sorry. Um... My, i'm done showering and everything it's my last night here i will miss beijing i wish i could stay longer i'm not getting used to the apartment so i'm not so creeped out like the first day i just wish i could stay longer just because of how nice it is here but every good thing has to come to an end i'm just here i'm so tired because i didn't sleep all day my body is used to having my afternoon nap chill oh my god I already used to having my afternoon nap, so I'm kind of tired, but I don't think I'll sleep anytime soon because it's so early. It's just like 7 something, 7.40 p.m. This apartment is like so staticky. Like I've been shocked yesterday when I went to get food at the door. Today on the sink and today when I was about to shower, the shower head. It just like, even last night, I thought I was hallucinating. I did, I did like this. See, I did this to the bed. And I swear I was seeing blue sparks. But then that happened just because I woke up in the middle of the night. So maybe I was hallucinating. Maybe it was real. It could have been real because of how much I've been shocked. I will not die in this place. Okay. I want to go back home. You know, yesterday I was on a video call with somebody. And I was like in the middle of the night. And I was like halfway asleep. And the person was like coming on the other side of the call. And you know, those creepy pictures and the faces in the living room. And I just watched like, <laughs> I just watched Blind Mano like, a few weeks ago so the humming plus my mid sleep mid awake mode plus me remembering those pictures i was looking creeped out i was like what what is it please stop for me what is it because i didn't want to just like the homie should stop and then i hear something keep going on in the background because the eyeless woman has popped out of her picture and she's moving around no okay i prayed so much last night i was so scared that's it for tonight. Peace out. Bye. Actually, not bye, but yeah. Good night. See you tomorrow morning. Hi, guys. So, today's the last day. My last day here in Beijing. I'll be leaving very soon. Time is 9.44 a.m. My flight leaves at 2.15. So, I'm thinking maybe I should leave my house like... 11 something yeah by 11 i'll leave so i get up by 12 so i have like the two hour time period that is recommended yeah that's what i'm gonna do so i don't have anything to do i'm already dressed and i'm doing my last minute packing there isn't really much to pack sha but i don't know let's see if i can carry this um what did i get the nachos from taco bell i can take it to travel back to fuju because i think i like nachos if I can take it to travel back to Fuji, then that's good. And I can give it to her. But I think I can't share because I broke cookies when I came. So, mm, all of them still food. So, it turns out that my flight is by 4 p.m. and I'm at 2 p.m. I don't know what I'm going to do yet <laughs> till 4 p.m. I've been watching The Queen's Gambit and it's interesting. So, I'm going to just continue doing that and just waste time until it's time for me to leave. In four freaking hours, I'm at McDonald's, as you can see, McDonald's, and I ordered McFlurry just so I could sit here. There are no charger spots around here, unfortunately, but I'll find a place. There definitely will be a place to charge. It is an airport. Let me waste time. Peace out. I just came back. I imagine as I was here, as I was coming out, these people were asking me where, when, when I went to go get my baggage at the baggage claim place, they were asking me for my boarding pass. Like, I came to steal someone's baggage. They didn't ask anybody else, they only asked me. Come here, Asha. 
So I got the airport bus, but it's sleeping at 8.40 and the time is like 7 something. It's not even 7 o'clock yet. Yeah, it's almost 8. 7.50. So I have like 30 minutes, I guess. Yeah, just about, sorry. Just about that.